so I just made it to Duncan. I am, I don't know if you guys can see that, probably not, but um, yeah, I'm about to get me a little coffee real quick. So I am just looking to help at least one person with this video today. I just want to at least be able to help one person who is dealing with like a depressing episode and just haven't been feeling motivated or been feeling like their best self. So if you're struggling today, just keep pushing, keep reminding yourself what your goal is, keep reminding yourself to be better, set goals for yourself look forward to something every single day like set a goal for yourself and achieve it and it takes time so like take baby steps i dealt with depression it's an ongoing thing you have to work towards becoming better i want to say that one more time you have to work towards becoming better i just want you guys to understand that work towards becoming better every single day it's an ongoing thing it's gonna it's gonna be continuous which brings us to number one and number one is gonna be to eat clean okay if you watch videos like this before you've probably seen people talk about it you've probably seen other youtubers say eat clean you know when you're dealing with depression because the junk food you're eating soda junk food processed foods anything like that it's causing depression it's a trigger for depression it is it's a trigger so for number two it's going to be to work out working out is not just for gaining weight losing weight or trying to maintain weight yes it is but it's not just for that you know we go there to for mental health like people see me go to the gym for my mental health i know i have a bigger purpose i know i have a bigger goal and it keeps me like sharp if i didn't go to the gym i wouldn't be making this video right now i would be too depressed to do that i would <laughs> and it sucks that's why like i'm a little sad that i wasn't able to work out today but i'm still gonna work out it's not gonna stop me like Stop letting people and stop letting things stop you from achieving your goals. You guys, I still have this coffee. Like it's watered down now. It's like not even cute anymore. Okay guys, um, so for three, for point three, it's gonna be to stay productive. And there's easy ways you can stay productive. You can get yourself a planner, a 2022 planner. I need to get a bigger one so I can write down everything. I picked up this just little book it says be kind for no reason at all i picked it up from bells and it was only 3.99 they have like cheap stuff there and like it's right by my gym i just write things down it's just like a blank paper you can just get you a normal notebook with blank paper you don't have to go all out and get a planner i mean personally i'm gonna go get a planner and i do recommend you guys go get a planner planners just help but if you don't want to do that, you can just pick up a little pretty notebook and just write down what you want. Last night, I wrote down what I wanted to do. I wrote down like everything I was doing for today. And honestly, I picked up my book when I woke up and I was like, I'm going to get this done. I'm going to get this done today. So when I went out today, I went to go get Duncan, right? Then right after I get Duncan, I was supposed to go to the gym. And I was gonna film my video like at the gym, maybe not at the gym, but like outside the gym a little bit. And that's what I was gonna do. That was, that was my intentions. That was my plan. That didn't get a chance to happen. I ended up going through something and kind of wish I never went outside now, <laughs> but I feel like it would have happened regardless. I don't wanna get into details. It's just something that I'm gonna have to deal with and I'm not gonna let it stop me from doing what I have to do. So I almost got stopped to make this video and I was like, no, I'm not going to do that. I'm not going to stop myself from making a video. I'm not going to do that. And I decided to just make the video. I, got, I almost got stopped. <laughs> That's what I'm trying to say is I almost got stopped from doing what I wanted to do. But my advice to you guys is 
no matter what, work around your resources, work with what you have, be productive. It helps. I feel a million times better because I didn't let what happened out there stop me from what I wanted to do today. I did everything I want. To, okay, I'm lying. <laughs> I didn't do everything I wanted to do today. I didn't go to the gym because of what happened. And yeah, but it's not going to stop me from working out. Like, you know, I can go outside. I can go jump rope. And that's honestly what I'm going to do after this video. I'm going to stay productive because if I don't, I'm going to think about what happened. I'm going to think about what just happened to me and I'm going to be sad, I'm going to be depressed and I'm going to be dealing with everything that I don't, what I'm telling you guys not to go through, you know. So this is probably, um, I'm probably just going to leave it at those three points because those kind of like sum it up. If you work on those things, if you work on eating clean, cutting out that junk food out of your diet and like incorporating smoothies into your life maybe in the morning or something or maybe just a little bit of more vegetables into your life then you will start to feel you will start to feel a little healthy